Hello, today's devotional can be found in Hebrews chapter 3 verse 7. Wherefore, as the Holy Ghost saith, today if ye will hear his voice. Okay. If we listen with our heart and our mind and everything that we can listen with, because we can do more than just listen with our ears. We can hear the still small voice of the Holy Ghost direct us and teach us where we need to go and what we need to do. The Lord will help us and guide us in what we need to do if we are willing to listen. And the Lord speaks primarily to the heart because the mind plays tricks and we don't even we don't always believe what our mind tells us when, and we don't always believe what's in our mind. But our heart, our heart speaks truth to us and the feelings in our heart that we feel are legitimate. And the Holy Ghost tells nothing but truth. Unlike the other voices in our lives that may lie for the sake of our comfort or theirs. The Holy Ghost is not loud either, so we really have to listen. It is a still, small voice that speaks to us and protects us and warns us about things that we are approaching that are not good for us to do. Mm. And we are very capable of listening. It's just a matter of whether or not we want to. Because we have the right to choose whether or not we listen to the Holy Ghost. But if we make choices that are not good, or if we don't listen to the Holy Ghost, it's not going to stay with us. It's going to go be with somebody that will listen to it. And it is a personage of spirit, so it can sit in our spirit and help us. As, as we want it to. Everything depends on agency. And we must choose for ourselves what we want in our life for ourselves. For what we want in this life is what we will get in the next life. And with that said, I love you all so very much. And the Holy Ghost comes to us through baptism. We are invited to receive it. And we cannot be afraid to make the choice for ourselves. For it is a choice whether or not we receive it unto ourselves and use it as a tool in our lives. And with that said, I love you all so very much, and I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.